Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alicia and today we have a very exciting video. We have our July new releases, but we do have some new things that I'm just trying. Um, I can't wait to show you guys. If you guys have seen the thumbnail, then you guys probably already know what it's gonna be, but we're definitely gonna get into that as well. But let's just go ahead and get right into it. I'm really, really excited. We're gonna go straight into all the budget kits first, like we normally do for the July new releases, and then we'll talk about the other new things that are gonna be coming. So the first thing is, let's talk about the July design one. This is the first design, and this design you guys might recognize from last year, though it is very different from what it used to look like. I actually don't even have an example with me to show you guys, but let's talk through it. We have the thin washi add-on, and then we have the thick washi add-on as usually and then of course the thick washi is like this beautiful floral print i thought for july because it's like a darker blue color i'm still so used to the erin conjuring colors but we have the, like the darker blue the red the pinks the baby blue there's like this gold faux glitter in the background they're like striped but i thought that would be really pretty for july i ended up putting a hoodie on because I'm really cold. I feel like I'm always cold. But okay, then the next sheet that we have here is the debt payment. This is the one that we've, um, it's like another add-on. This sheet is not a part of any of the bundles. It is just an add-on option. So we have the thick washi, we have two thin washies. We have the debt name for whatever it is, the starting amounts for the month. Um, at the very beginning then whatever the interest is the minimum payment that you have to pay whatever additional payment that you want to pay towards that debt and then whatever the end balance is i like to basically see what the difference is like for example if you start with a hundred dollars you pay 25 but you still end with like 80 dollars i know that's like really that, that the interest must be high for that but i like to be able to see the starting and the end amount for the debt payments and then we have the script the total paid that you can put at the bottom for whatever the total amount is that you paid for the month and then we have our kit so let's talk about version one first and then we'll talk about version two so version one is the six pages this is the version that i always use when you guys see my budget videos we have the july budget and uh, and if you guys are curious about any of these sheets, I definitely do set them all up with you guys on camera. And I show you guys how I utilize them. But essentially, because I, I feel like I never talk about the designs anymore. But we have our strips at the top for like the income that you have coming in. Whether it's like the household, yours, husband's, extra, whatever you want to put up there. If you guys know, I like to split up all of my expenses the first section i always this top part i always like to have as if like my day-to-day -day expenses i will be using cash in june i know i've been talking about this for some time now i feel like but in june i will be using or trying cash for maybe that month and a couple of months to just show you guys how i would use it as a hybrid since you guys know we are cashless and we only use everything electronically um but yes this top part here is what i use for our day-to-day -day, our cash envelopes then we have another fix for like our sinking funds the savings that we have then the bottom part this is specifically for all of our bills we have all of our variable bills and our fixed bills since i love to keep our bills separated because bills we can't really adjust if need be and then we have the weekly check-in weekly check-in and weekly balance. I have both of these sheets that I utilize. This one is to calculate our day-to-day -day expenses. And then this one is to calculate our checking account because I have all of those categories in our checking account and I need to be able to calculate it. And then the next sheet is our sinking funds and transaction log as well. We have our savings tracker and our variable income. So these are all the six sheets that come in the first version of the bundle. Next, we have bundle two, the version two, version two bundle. <laughs> but for version two, there is seven sheets in here. And essentially all of the sheets are the same, except instead of the July budget, it is for the paycheck one and the paycheck two. These two are, the same exact sheet as the july budget except 
it'll say paycheck one and paycheck two as the scripts instead but this is for version two and then the rest of the sheets are all the same as well and this one is um this is like the one that does not say the month like this one says july so really this one if you wanted to you could use this for any month honestly but this is what the version but this is what the design one of the design for july looks like now let's talk about design two so i feel like it sounds so groggy <laughs> but for design two this is what it looks like i thought this was so cute and pretty for july because you know like on the sea <laughs> at the beach um but it is a definitely have a more kind of like what is it muted is it really it's, it's still bright but it's like not as bold as uh, the first design and you guys already know i love to do like a floral and also like like not a non-floral print for those of you guys who don't like floral but we have our thin washi and you guys already see it's like this really pretty pink one um you guys probably already noticed that for this month both of the thin washies are glitter i always switch it up because like sometimes i just don't have anything that pairs well with it so this month i thought the glitter went really really well especially because like you know july sparkly fireworks so i wanted to do like a glittery thing for both of them but anyway so this is the thick washi which is so cute it's like this watercolor there is um the lighthouse a boat a little starfish in there little bubbles so this is definitely called july for me and i think this is honestly the one i'm going to use oh speaking of i forgot to show you guys what it looks like i always show you guys and sometimes i forget but let me show you guys what it looks like for design one so this is what july the, the first design looks like so you guys can see it's really blue and like the red it's so cute and this planner that i'm using this is a plum paper planner but in my budget videos i do use an erin condren planner and both of these are in seven by nine so you guys can see the way it fits like a plum paper and then of course my budget videos you guys see that it fits the erin condren and i do also offer monthlies for the erin condren and plum paper as well i always forget to mention plum paper when i do the new releases but this is what the first design looks like all right going back to design two we have the debt payment and i'm not going to go over like the format again since we talked about it for the first design but we have our version one bundle which is the july budget you have to see it's very like a, a sweeter theme um a, they're sweeter colors i guess is this is, i don't even know if that's the right word i'm not sure if i'm th so fast thinking about <laughs> oh my god i'm not sure if i'm like making sense but please do not mind me <laughs> okay then we have our sinking funds did i even say anything for the last two okay we have our weekly balance our weekly check-in then of course we have our sinking funds and transaction log our savings tracker and then we have our variable income and also just to quickly talk about the sinking funds and transaction log um when i had someone ask me about the transaction log and this transaction log is specifically for the sinking funds so if you wanted to track like because for me i have my sinking funds separated out from like my monthly view and all of that i keep it separated since whatever money i take out of sinking funds i like to track it in the transaction log to keep it specifically for this but you definitely don't have to if you, if you want to track your sticky funds in the monthly view or wherever you want to like it's just stickers that are here to, um, to assist you if you need it but um you definitely could utilize this for something else as well like if you wanted to do a transaction log for savings or if you want to do a transaction logs for just like the overall spending for the month for whatever you wanted to use it for that is there too but yes this is the version one um of course again this is the six pages this is the one that i use and then for the version two is just the same sheets but except for instead of this one we have the paycheck one and the paycheck two of course the images will also be in the listing too for which version comes with what sheets and as always all of these are also available a la carte too so if you didn't want a bundle you could definitely just do like the individual sheets but yes and these stickers are made to order as well hopefully one day i'll be able to do it as like a um, ready to ship as of right now 
since I'm so tiny, <laughs> I don't want to have like a crazy overstock amount. So it just makes sense for me to just do a made to order. As always, you guys already know that even though my processing time is like one to two weeks, I always try to get it out before the one week mark. I always try to get it out within like three to five days. It used to be a lot better, but with our baby and stuff, it's just been a lot harder to be able to <laughs> get things out quickly. Even though like three to five days is still pretty quick. I'm trailing off. Okay, hold on. Where are we? We're talking about the budget kits now. Not the budget kits. The calendars. Okay, so we have the first design for July. Oh, wait a second. Oh, I almost forgot. I have to show you guys this. So this is the design too for July. And honestly, I am really vibing with this one. I think I am going to be using this one for July. They're both gorgeous, but something about like how soft this July one is, I really, I think I'm going to be using this one. I know I always talk to you guys in these release videos to tell you guys which one I'm going to be utilizing. It's always so fun, but just to show you guys the differences, because I know that this theme is blue as well as June. This was for June's kits, so this is what they looked like. And then this is for July, so as you guys can see, it's still very different. Um, especially with the additions of the reds, but yes, so that is what this looks like for July. Now for the monthlies, we have our version 1, and this is, oops, for July version 1, and this is the dashboard page. I do have, uh, um, this is in the Erin Condren size, I do have the plum paper size as well, but that is also going to be in a separate listing. The Erin Condren one in the Air, um, in the plum paper one, for the monthlies, those are in separate listings, you guys will see them in the listing title. But this is the July one, this is the dashboard, and of course the monthly for the Erin Condren comes with the day dots, so this is the monthly on its own. The dashboard is also available on its own as well if you guys don't utilize it. And then we also have all the add-ons. We have the bill dues, so you guys can see what the colorway is. And then we have the non spent stickers. Then we have color one, which is this really pretty peach color. Is it a peach? It's like a light nudie peach. It's like a, a very unripe peach color <laughs> but that's the color one color two is this gray blue color it's like um i got this from the baby blue color but i feel like i've had baby blues i try to have different colorways but as i do these kits more and more i realize like a lot of colors repeat i don't know if it's a personal issue because i always gravitate towards the same colors <laughs> but i do at least try to make the four colors in total different but yeah, the next color after that is this pink color, and then of course we have that dark, dark blue color. I was thinking about doing a red, but I felt like a red was kind of harsher, so I didn't end up doing a red for this one, but this is what it looks like for the colorway for the July one, the July design one. And these naming conventions are, um, as usually, BC for budget calendar, and then we have 723 for July 2023 and then dash one for design one. Same with the budget kits. The budget kits, instead of BC, it's BK for budget kit, but then the numbers is the same for 723 for July 2023, design one. And then we have design two, of course, which is that, that shippy ocean new design. So we have our first one, which is the monthly, then we have the dashboard, and then we have our add-ons, which is the bill dues, and this is the difference between the two. So this is the colorway for the design two, this is the colorway for the design one. It kind of reflects the same like muted colors. I don't know if you guys can really see that on camera. I do film with my phone, so I don't really know if that shows well, but that is the difference between the two of them. Then we have the nun spent, we have color one color two, which is like this raspberry color, color three, and then color four. And just to compare color three and color four with you guys, this one's a little bit more blue, this one's a little bit more gray. So that is what these colors all look like. 
and then of course this is offered as a i'm talking so slow oh my god so <laughs> and of course these are also offered in a bundle so the whole bundle is comes with all of these sheets how many sheets is this two four six eight sheets and then of course the dots are here too um there is also an option to do the bundle without the dashboard if you don't want the dashboard and then of course as always these are all also available a la carte too so you can customize your own kit if you'd like but that is what the july ones look like for the new releases now let's talk about the new 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 <laughs> new stuff coming um this is really a trial so even though it is new i don't really have much stock because these will be based on stock and ready to ship because i'm really trying to hopefully one day go towards being a ready to ship shop okay so let's talk about the new stuff i'm really excited this is not like i have so many things that are like i'm working on but a lot of things that i'm really like worried about too because i'm like uh, I don't know if anyone's gonna like this, but um, I but I'm still like excited because like I'm excited for myself. I guess let's 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 just go into it. So these are going to be ready to ship because I am gonna be doing it based on stock. So once I run out, I'll have like a restock day for whatever items to be restocked. I don't even know what the heck I'm saying, but the first one is going to be these little butterfly paper clips so you can definitely have um, them as like a bookmark you can have them hanging on the bottom too if you wanted to i'm going to be using these as like my new different bookmarks for them and i think they're so gorgeous this one is um here let me show you guys what it looks like so this is a on a heart paper clip so this one is gold with a black butterfly and that is what this looks like. All of them are around three centimeters long for like the, the paperclip portion. And then with the butterfly, um, I guess you could say it's around four-ish centimeters long. But that is these little butterfly, butterfly ones. And they're so precious. Oh my god, I love them. And then I will have a, currently it's gonna be six colors of each and these are very low stock like i wasn't because like i'm so nervous about it i didn't end up making a lot of them so i believe there's only like two or three of each color so we have all the golds and then we have the pink i kind of wish like this would be better okay so i tried to zoom up i thought my phone camera was pretty decent but maybe it's not but I hope that this is like a little bit better. <laughs> okay, but I zoomed in so I can show you guys that it's two different, there's two different paper clips. There is the gold one and the rose gold one. And then I have uh, six colors of each. So we have the pink, we have the black, then we have the purple, we have the white, the yellow, and the blue. So this is what they all look like. I'll probably have to like take a picture or something later on in like sunlight. They're so pretty though. Look at this pink on pink for the rose gold. Like that is so pretty. And then the yellow on yellow for the gold. I'm so excited for these. I think these are so gorgeous. So these will also be releasing on Friday along with the July kids. And again, there is, they're very slow stock. There's like, I think there's three... For the gold ones of each color and two of the rose gold ones for each color this is like my first time releasing something that's not stickers so this is what they look like i hope that you guys is excited about it as i am but this is what they look like okay so let me here let me just put the rose gold ones away and let me show you guys what these look like i'm just gonna shove them all in the, the book right here and then i'll show you guys what it looks like Okay, so this is what they all look like down, and then when closed, this is what it looks like in there. Focus. There we go. So this is what they look like in there. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. I'm so obsessed with these. I'm really so obsessed with these. But this is what they all look like in the binder. And I also took photos of each one too. 
so you guys can see them but yeah so this is what they look like and of course since they are paper clips if you guys have like a heavy book or if you guys press down it will leave indents like for me just now i i was squeezing my book because i'm very excited right now so i'm, I'm manhandling myself right now a little bit but you guys can see that i left a little bit of indents because i was squeezing it like this but that's also to note too so just like any paper clips it will leave like an, a slight indent as well if you leave it over time if you put weight on it that's just going to happen oh and before i forget i have to plug this in somewhere the backings of the butterflies are gold so even the rose gold one the back is gold so i don't know if that mixed metal will bother you guys so i just wanted to make sure you guys know about the the gold back but this is what the front looks like but the next thing i wanted to show you guys is i'm really sorry for this one too this okay why is my camera trolling me today it keeps not focusing but this is what i want to show you guys as well it's like another paperclip bookmark but of course as you guys can see it is a bow oh my gosh and uh, these i've been so excited about oh my god i've been wanting to sneak these for a while honestly i wasn't going to release these until next month but i decided to release them now but look at how cute this is these are also low stock i only have like three of each of these two because these take a million years for me to make because i have to hand make the bow i have to glue them i have to seal off the bows too i have to wait for the glue to set then i have to glue it onto the paper clip because these move around so much because it is satin so now that i glued them down like they don't move as much of course they still move because it is fabric but they're like in place but of course you can definitely like manhand this and like rip it off of the the paper clip but these are very large paper clips these are like two inch paper clips yeah, these are like just under five um, centimeters, but they're like two inch paper clips or just under two inch paper clips, maybe 1.9 inch paper clips. So they're huge paper clips. And then of course you guys can see there is like this really cute little bear on it with a little heart. So a bear with a heart inside of a heart with a bow. Like this is, oh my God. <laughs> so this is what it looks like. And these are definitely like a lot more time consuming because I do have to like put jumpers on everything just like the butterflies but this one especially because like the bow I have to like mess with it so much to be able to get it to look somewhat nice <laughs> so this is what it looks like and then I get like glue all over the place too but of course like this is what the bow looks like and the bear like this is so adorable I like I love this so I cannot wait to start using this. So this is the rose gold one. So rose gold with a, a pink gold bow. And then of course the bear. I don't know if you guys can see on bear. But the bear is a little bit more copper colored than the rose gold paper clip. I could be colorblind but I don't really notice it that much. And then I do have a second one which is a gold one with like the yellow bow. And then also a gold bear and this is what that looks like too so let me put this one on too but this is what they look like so as you guys can see they are handmade with love with a lot of love so each one is not going to look exactly the same but this is what it looks like in the planner and i just love them so much and of course just like with the butterfly clips if you guys do like these i definitely will make more and bring more to the shop but another thing that i wanted to show you guys is that you can also put this in like your planners too like if you guys have like um the a5 or a6 the planner that i have right now is a a6 this is actually going to be what i'm going to be using for june since you guys already know i'm going to be using our trying cash so this is what i'm going to be using i thought this looked so cute with the june budget i'm going to be using because it's all like rainbow e and like pastel -y and adorable so this is what it looks like and this binder i did get as a sample from a supplier because i am i'm playing around with stuff right now i'm definitely playing around with stuff right now so i do apologize i'm not able to like link this but yeah i did want to just show you guys what it'll look like if you guys do put it like in your planner too and this is so 
cute like i love this so so much i have cloud planners too the oracel cloud so you can definitely put these in there too but it's just such like a beautiful little accent and yes and also put that in here too and it just shows at the top oh my god i love these so much They're so cute. i'm so happy with these like honestly but yeah so this is my we'll talk about this more in june because there's definitely some stuff i want to flip and show you guys and talk to you guys about but we'll talk about this in june we'll talk about this in june most likely the june budget with me video will be going up next week at some point if not the following week of course but that is what those look like and then let me also talk to you guys about like how they're gonna be packaged so i also made my own backing cards for these paper clips because like i just don't i want them to be well protected and like the structure to stay i don't have to put this one upside down i put this one upside down so i need to fix that but they're gonna be like this and again, I only have a three of each of these, two, but this is what they'll look like. And the backing cards, I did cut myself too, so if they're a little like crooked, I do apologize. But hopefully it's not that noticeable. So that this is what those bare bow clips will be coming in. And then of course we have like a three-ish of each of my two or three each of the little butterfly ones too. But that is what these look like. I hope that you guys are as excited and you guys like these as much as I do. I've definitely been working on these for quite some time playing with different materials and everything like that and try to figure out for the life of me how to tie a beautiful bow because like tying a bow on like a shoe versus tying it just like in thin air it took me it took definitely it i'm still learning let's just let's just go with that so these do ta take a lot of time but it's definitely time well 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 worth it <laughs> i love them so much yeah so that is actually going to be it now for this new releases um, I hope that you guys enjoyed it. This is definitely a longer new releases for sure, talking about everything, but I do hope that you guys did enjoy it. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video overall, and hopefully, um, let me know what you guys think, and hopefully I'll see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye! <laughs>